Thank you, Mr. President. Mr. President, Washington County unemployment 9%, Clackamas County unemployment 10.1%, Marion County, and these colleagues are counties that are faring much better in our recession. Marion County 11% unemployment, Baker County 13.1%, Columbia County 14.1%, Crook County 20% unemployment, uh, many others on the east side, Grant County, for instance, over 20% unemployment. It's easy in this building to get f consumed by the looming $4.4 billion projected deficit, the information that we last received from the co-chairs. $4 billion is a very scary number, and it has very scary implications for all of the services that we provide to Oregonians. But it isn't nearly as scary as the $40 billion contraction in Oregon's economy, that $40 billion contraction that comes from Oregonians' earnings, their wages, from their paychecks, from their businesses, and from their investments. If you want to know what it means to be scared, talk to some of the more than 250,000 Oregonians who can't find a job right now, who have no idea how they're going to pay their rent, have no idea how they're going to pay for groceries or their water bills. We're approaching the halfway session, the halfway point in the session. We're almost there. And yet the unemployment rate continues to climb. On your desk, colleagues, there are 10 specific ideas for creating jobs in Oregon. Some require minimal investment. Some don't cost the state a dime. But all of them will give Oregonians the security of a paycheck that they need and want. Mr. President, colleagues of both parties, we are ready to put Oregon back to work, and we would like your help and your cooperation to do just that. Please let's work together to create jobs. Thank you, Mr. President.